Hello and welcome. I'm Rose from eTravel Safety. We're on a mission to enable anyone, anywhere to travel safely. There's been a huge rise in firearms and weapons attacks at tourist spots in recent years, and our aim is to help you understand what to do if you're caught in one. In the recent events around the world, it's a reminder to us that some people are prepared to use firearms and weapons to attack innocent people. We will have all seen the atrocities where people are gunned down in schools, nightclubs, or even hacked to death on the street. The reasons for these attacks can be from a religious extremist to someone who's been bullied. A whole host of reasons can be behind the attacks, but the results are devastating. Since the rise in this type of attack, a whole host of advice has been given about how to stay safe in this situation. Our advice is to run, hide and tell. This is easy to remember and provides you with quick, easy steps that can help you stay safe or even save your life. If you're ever caught in these circumstances, first run and if you can, escape. Try to consider your safest options to get out without exposing yourself to more danger. If it's possible, try to get other people to leave with you and never bother about your personal belongings. If you can't get a safe way out of the building, then hide. Don't just hide behind a curtain. Try and get good cover, out of sight, that provides you protection from gunfire, like a thick wall. If you can, get in a room and lock or barricade it. This will provide some more protection and hopefully be enough until the military or law enforcement come to the rescue. It would be better if you're not trapped, but this isn't always possible. However, make sure that you have your phone on silent and off vibrate. If you can make a call without giving your hiding place away, call the emergency services and help provide them with information about the attackers. If it's not possible to speak, you might be able to listen to their instructions. When the military or law enforcement rescue you, it's important to understand how they could behave. Always follow their instructions. This might be harder in another country where you don't speak the language, so try to be non-threatening. Always avoid sudden movements and keep your hands in view. Be aware that you may be treated firmly and questioned until they're happy that you're not one of the attackers. This might involve pointing weapons at you, so remain calm and comply with what you're ordered to do. If you need medical help, Make sure that you get this as soon as possible. Always look to have professional help on the longer term psychological impact that this could have on you. At the end of this video, we want to look at the key points to help you stay safe and survive if you're ever caught in a firearms and weapons attack. Remember that if this dreadful situation happens to you, you need to think about what you're going to do if you're caught in a firearm and weapons attack. Know in your head what run, hide, tell means for you. And know what to do after the event. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to check out the other bundles across our range to help you enjoy and stay safe when you travel.